Ah, Moray. Nobody ever liked you. Today, we're going to be breaking Moray Towers. I'm going to show you some amazing spots and routes that'll give you the upper hand if you're good at coordinating with your teammates, especially in Rainmaker. In no way is this a full list of tricks you can pull off on this map, it's really what I found useful. If any of you guys know any similar tricks, let me know in the comments below. I might be making more similar episodes for other maps soon, meaning this may or may not be the first episode in the series. Regardless, let's go. Chargers on Moray. Ugh. So we all know there's two flank routes that lead up to the Chargers pod. One directly up the wall, and one around on the right. But what if I told you, there's another flank route that nobody expects. Roll the clip. While this route may be a bit annoying to ink, you can ink it fairly fast using burst bombs and either a charger or something like a jet sculpture. If you don't have one, you can finish it off from above if you get the chance. Sadly, this might not be as viable due to it being a bit hard to ink the path. However, there's another even more viable route, especially useful in Rainmaker. You can go around on the wall above the splat zone and avoid hopping on the second platform just to hop directly onto the Rainmaker cone. This makes you practically impossible to hit from the other side of the wall, where your opponents will likely be standing. This goes great with a teammate using a Kraken, as you can just follow them and not waste time making the path. This requires some epic team coordination, but when done right, it's a really powerful strategy. You can chain this with going around the wall near the splat zone to really get the surprise in on your opponent. If they're not expecting your strategies, you've got a pretty good shot of pulling off the trick. Hey, thanks for watching. First of all, I just want to give a big shout out to Slimy and MH. They helped me find these tricks, and without them, this video wouldn't really be possible. So thanks, guys. I'm planning on making more videos like this one soon, so please hit that subscribe button to let me know you want to see more. I'm also trying to start up a Twitch, so feel free to give me a follow if you want to see me live or play some Turf Wars or Pyre Battles with me. Just click the link in the description below. Stay fresh, everybody!